Reventador volcano can be described as tall, dark, and handsome. It is tall, three and a half kilometer almost. It is dark, as you can see here. It's made of basalt on most of the, uh, you know, the flanks and the rocks of it, and there's that basalt, these kind of rocks. At the same time, it's handsome, as you can see in the eruptions of it. When it erupts, all those glowing amber of the rocks flow toward the lower elevations, creating these beautiful scenes for us to watch. Something that we can see, you know, from a safe distance and enjoy. <laughs> if you're close to it, that's not so much pleasure in that. And listen to the lightning and the sound of the rolling lava bombs. Can be scary. It's dark as the night. And when it erupts, you know that it's adding a lot of gas to the atmosphere. This is all the gas and the water that the oceanic crust of the Nazca plate has absorbed over the millennia, over the millions of years. And now is subducted under, under the South American plate and is melting and coming back in the form of these pimples in these four volcanoes. All the water comes back. It's a recycle, uh, recycling center. In a way, it's a conveyor belt. Another point on the planet, um, more, um, more actually, ground oceanic crust is being built. Like what is it in the Iceland? This is the conveyor belt of the planet Earth for the tall, dark, handsome volcanoes.